hey guys welcome back to my channel or I guess let me welcome myself back to my channel don't mind my appearance I my life right now is a mess we are in the middle of moving we get the keys to the new house today my house is a disaster my child has been super 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 fussy so mama just has been having a rough time here um, the past couple weeks have been pretty hectic. Like I said, we're in the middle of moving. Uh, we actually were having a little bit of trouble finding a place. I'm not sure if I've mentioned this before, but we just sold, sorry if I'm kind of shaky, I'm really hungry, but we just sold our house. We're gonna be renting for a little bit. So we we're in the process of like looking for a place to rent and we finally found one. So, like I said, we get the keys today, so we're going to be moving some stuff. I'm really excited. Um, but, yeah, the past couple weeks, I have been really, really, really busy. Like I mentioned in, I believe, my last vlog, I just got a new job that what I thought was going to be great for our family because it was, like, supposed to be per diem. So, I gave them my availability, told them I'm only available, like, two to three days a week. But they were scheduling me like crazy, like 40 hours a week. And so I was working really long hours. It was at a hospital, so they were long hours. And I was like leaving in the morning, coming home late at night, and it was just not good. So with that being said, I'm back to being a full-time stay-at-home mom. And that is just what works for our family right now. I wanted to just share a couple of things with you guys. Uh, we have all these moving boxes here. You guys, this is just the kitchen stuff. That's all that I have got packed. So I have been a little bit under the weather, so my voice is a little bit raspy. Sorry, I'm trying to put this monitor up. Leave it standing up. It keeps falling. My voice is a little bit raspy, but I just want to share with you guys a couple of things that I bought the other day for the new house. Like I said, we're just renting, so... Um, I'm not getting too crazy with like brand new things like decorations and stuff like that but since it is a new house I did want to just buy a few things just to make it feel a little bit more cozy and homey that's even a word okay so I don't want to take this out of the bag fully but it's just a set of bath mats it comes with a big one and then a small one so I'm gonna put the big one in the guest bathroom and the small one in our bathroom and then over here, uh, this is all stuff from Home Goods, by the way. So over here is um, just a white shower curtain. I just thought I'd just keep it white instead of getting crazy with colors. And by the way, guys, I haven't even seen the house yet because I was working so much. Alex, my husband, went to go see the house. It's a new built, so um, nobody has lived in it before. So I just trusted him to find the house. He took videos. It's it's nice it's it's good for us um it's good for us it's a good size it's anyways a shower curtain liner you guys don't want to hear all that but a shower curtain liner to go with this like i said just keeping it very very simple i got one of these <laughs> you guys i'm ridiculous i got one of these egg container things to like store your eggs you know those restocking videos i'm freaking obsessed and you know that's like a dream of mine to make my fridge look super pretty and who knows maybe even do restocking videos i'm just obsessed with it i love the sound anyways so i got that for the eggs i got one of these lemon holders i was looking for a lime one because we use a lot of lime but i couldn't find one so a lemon one will work it's the same thing i got one of these avocado pod that's Okay, yeah, it's called avocado pod, but it's just to store your avocado to keep it fresh. And then I got an onion storage pod because we needed a new one of these as well. So that's everything that I got. Well, actually, that's not everything. I also bought two soap dispensers, but I don't know where they're at. I don't know if they're somewhere around here or... The, well, they're not at the store because I called the store and they're not there. So I have to go get my money back for those. But anyways, let me just show you guys what I got from Hobby Lobby. Um, this is like more of Christmas stuff, but I'm going to be having a Christmas girls night pretty soon. And I got this tablecloth here with like cute little trailers. 
And then I got this tablecloth for Thanksgiving because we're hosting Thanksgiving at the new house. My in-laws are coming and our really good friends are going to come and it's going to be fun. I picked up one of these acorn picks, just one. I thought this would be really cute in like the guest bathroom just to add a little bit of Christmas in there. And Xander's birthday is coming up next month and his party is a winter wonderland theme. And this matches his invitations, it's so cute. So I picked this up, it lights up also. And the last thing I got from Hobby Lobby is this truck sign, is this frame and it just has the red truck that says Mary and it's super cute. But yeah, like I said, I'm just trying to keep things pretty simple, not go too crazy. I have to see what I have and Christmas stuff. But anyways, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Guys, we're on our way to the new house right now. We're going to unload both of our cars. We just packed them up as much as we could. We're going to end up getting like a U-Haul for all the bigger furniture, like the bed and the couch. But for now, since the house, the new house is so close, we just figured we'll just pack up what we can. And then go from there our friends are gonna come help us unpack later but yeah like I said I haven't been to the new house yet I've just seen a video of it so yeah Xander's in the car with Alex in front of me but yeah I'll see you guys when we get to 